It is back to the books for students at the state's biggest colleges. The fall semester got underway today at UGA, Georgia Tech, and Georgia State. The CBS Atlanta's Rebecca Schramm is at GSU where enrollment is at an all-time high. Mr. Passarello, Mr. Passarello. Ashley Bryant is a freshman from Thomasville. She almost chose to go to Clark Atlanta University, but instead she picked Georgia State. As well, Clark is a private school. I like the um, environment there, but this one, it was a public school and I could I will, it would help me better um, financially. Georgia State University is seeing a record enrollment this year with close to 3,000 freshmen. Altogether, 30,000 students are enrolled here. The down economy is sending some of the more sought after students Georgia State's way. The average GPA for its freshman class is 3.35. That's up from a 3.32 average last fall. It's where we probably would have seen some of those students go to pr the private institutions, maybe have gotten higher scholarship packages. Have decided that the public institution um, offers some quality programming, but also uh, it's a little bit lighter on the pocketbook. The economy is also sending people like Zachary Smith back to the classroom. He retired after 20 years in the Army and now wants to become a teacher, emphasizing in special education. I say, that, you know, I can't really make it, you know, in the job market with uh, a 12th grade education. So I needed to, uh, you know, really it's kind of like the speed of the process and then getting into college and getting a degree. But something else that might be helping to boost Georgia State's enrollment, it's no longer the commuter school it used to be. There's a lot more on-campus housing and there's a lot of buzz on campus about the football program that begins next fall. So most definitely we've transformed in a very, very short period of time to um, a, a much more traditional institution. Just the kind of change small town girl Ashley Bryant wanted. It's a lot of people. I didn't expect it to be this many people, but I'm kind of trying to get used to it right about now. In downtown Atlanta, Rebecca Schramm, CBS Atlanta News.